Here's some quick tips on building your SO101 robot. This is the flagship robot from the Low Robot Project by Hugging Face. It's a great affordable platform for learning robotics at home. And who doesn't need robots in their garage? This flat screwdriver was perfect for snapping in these connectors. Just listen to that nice click. Just double check that the pins are aligned before pressing. Press on the thicker part of the connector and be gentle. Next is to use the debug app provided by the servo manufacturer if you run into issues with the motors or need to test. You may also need to update firmware for your motors and this is the tool to do it. Lastly, this might sound obvious, but I think just laying out your parts ahead of time and organizing everything before you start building really helps. And the leader arm uses different motors for different axes, so being organized helps you avoid having to remove them and repress them in. Using a tray for the screws and servo horns makes it harder to drop screws or misplace one of your servo horns. Now I haven't fully calibrated mine, but it's already really fun to drive around and I'm excited to do more projects with this platform. Thanks for watching.